The PS4 is a console that I have recently been considering buying. If I did, it would be my first PlayStation console ever. But one of the main reasons why I'm holding off on getting one is because I want to get the PS5 and have it for its entire life. So Michael Pachter, who is a video game analyst, decided to talk more about the PS5, specifically when the device is coming out. So when is it? People have been guessing at this for years now. Well, Michael Pachter said the following about the device. My expectation is that they're not going to have it come out in 2018, that it will be 2019 or 2020, but probably 2019. Sony is probably timing it better because they are going to bring out a 4K capable device when the 4K TV market reaches 50% in the US and 35% in the rest of the world. He also talked a little bit of what he expects the performance to be like and he stated that the PS4 Pro is better from a technical perspective than the PS4 so I think that's a half step towards the PS5. I think the PS5 will be another half step. Now something else interesting he talked about was the possibility of the console having games run at 240 frames per second. So let's first talk about the release date. Let's just say that all of this is 100% true. 2019 was kind of the year I didn't really think too much about for the PS5's release. I kind of more really only thought of 2018 or 2020, but 2019 isn't it isn't like, oh no, I can't buy the PS5 now because it's coming out in 2019. It's more like, oh, well, well then that that's slightly interesting. So, it did catch me off guard, but it's now the whole thing of being a half step up from the Pro, if you visualize it, it kind of makes sense because the PS4, as I visualize it, is kind of like the number 0, and the PS4 Pro is like the 0 0.5, and the PS5 would be the P number. So it makes sense to me at least where Michael is going with this. Do I think that's actually how it's going to be as a half step up from the Pro? I have no idea. This could be 100% right or 100% wrong. And since I have never owned a PlayStation console, I have no idea what it'll be. Now something interesting is the possibility of having games run at 240 frames per second. Now Michael did say that there- Now Michael did say that it would easily run 4K, but I mean, that's probably not gonna happen for 240 frames, cause let's say that the games do run at 4K 240 uh, frames per That's ridiculous, cause the Xbox One X can sometimes only achieve 60 frames per second at 4K, and just only two years later, a device pushing that. I don't know, if it does, it's gonna be real expensive. That's for sure. Maybe, maybe Sony will take a loss on it, I have no- I would say that the specs are probably hard to pin at this time, but the release date of 2019, I'd say that's true. And who knows, I might even do an unboxing of it. So if you did find this video interesting, please share this video on social media. Please also send me any topics by PMing me on YouTube, and if you ask for it, you might get shouted out for it. And also, please leave your thoughts on this in the comment section below, and see you.